Hello, I'm going to talk about paying it forward. You know how you always hear about people paying it forward and you just never did? You thought about it, but you never did? I suggest that you do that. Did something today. I paid it forward. Vicki and I had a bag of some food items that we really don't use. You have those right now in your pantry, right? I bet you got some in your pantry. I bet you got food that is in your pantry that's still good, that's not past the expiration date, the born on dating or whatever. Take that food, put it into a gift bag. Put it all into a gift bag. I had stuff and a gift bag. There was even some lotion in there uh, for ladies. <clears throat> So what I did was first I drove around. In my town, I know about where some of the homeless people hang. And unfortunately, I didn't see any for them, unfortunately for them. So I went and I sat facing my car towards the front door of the Salvation Army, watching for people to come out. And I noticed that there was a lady at the checkout with a little person, a little girl. And I thought, yeah, they're going to get it. So I waited and I waited. And I went, oh, I had my bag ready with me in the front seat. And as they were coming out, I saw them into the foyer part of the Salvation Army, got out of my car with the bag. And I went up to her very slowly while they were still on the sidewalk and asked her if she had ever heard of the pay it forward thing. And she says, yes. And I said, well, it's time for me to pay forward. And you're the lucky one to get it. I told her that we had a bag with food items in it. And they were for her. And that she could take them and use them and do whatever they want with them. And it's all good stuff. This wasn't garbage stuff. This wasn't stupid stuff uh, that you have in your pantry that you would never eat. Like mincemeat or something, you know. But I gave it to her, and we talked a little bit, and she had a little tear. You believe that, man? She had a little tear in her eye, you know? It was a grandmother with a grandchild. And she said that she was doing her best to buy a few items at the Salvation Army store to help her daughter, who was having a hard time, and the child. Go try that. Do that. Grab some items out of there you don't use. Make sure it's good. Make sure it's not like good until something 16 and it's already almost 2017. That's kind of foolish, right? But do that. Wait for someone. Pick someone up. You know, and, and walk up to them nicely and introduce yourself and give it to them. Tell them it's a pay forward deal. I'm here to tell you what. Wow. You know, people need that. People need help. I've been there. I are there. I is here. I am to the point in my life where it's hard. Um, and, and everybody is. I don't care if you're working four jobs or no jobs. It's tough. So please, grab some food. Get some together in a bag. Put it in a gift bag at the dollar store. Take it out and do it. If you don't change or have a heart tug to do that, I don't know what to say. Get off my Facebook. <laughs> anyway, do it. Have fun. All right. Merry Christmas. We already had that already. It's past that. But Happy New Year. I hope you have a better year in 2017 than we ever had in 2016. And I have nothing to toast with, but I do have my, my Vicky cup here. She got me this cup here with... All the pictures of the stuff we did in 2016. Isn't that cool or what? You know? And she says, but it's pink. And I said, I don't care. It's from you. It's the person I love. You know, it's from her, you know? And so anyway, toast to you people to do this. Go out there and pay forward, please. We need it. I know you can't afford to put money in the... Uh, collection plates, I know you can't really afford to do some time money when they have the dingers out there with the Salvation Army. I get it. I get it.
you get tired of it right up to here, here, and here with it. But pay forward. Give some food to somebody. Make somebody smile. Later.